Hello fellow lightworkers, this is your mystic from Mount Shasta, Dr. Christina, intuitive guide and author. If you are new to my channel, I have been inspiring and supporting fellow lightworkers as we shift into a higher state of consciousness and help the collective with this ascension process. Today is June 21st and we are experiencing a full moon in Capricorn the day after the summer solstice. Yesterday's summer solstice was extra special because it was followed by this full moon in Capricorn and created a grand cross with Neptune, the planet of illusions and dreams, at the 29th degree of Pisces, which is the critical degree. All of this is big energy. Full moons are about illuminating and releasing things that no longer serve us. Today's full moon is in Capricorn, and Capricorn represents responsibility and hard work. It's the father sign of the zodiac. However, the shadow aspects of Capricorn are workaholism, greed, materialism, and obtaining power at any cost. Our next full moon is also in Capricorn. It's highly unusual to have two full moons back to back in the same sign, which indicates a strong push to release the shadow aspects of Capricorn individually and collectively, as well as whatever is blocking us from taking responsibility and putting in the work we signed up to accomplish in this new age. It is very interesting that Pluto, the planet of transformation, is currently retrograding in Aquarius and will make its final retrograde into Capricorn in September. These full moons are working in tandem with this energy to really transform the Capricorn structures in our lives, such as government, corporations, and the financial system. Additionally, with the solstice being aspected by Neptune, the planet of illusions in Pisces, at its detriment point, we will likely further see some clearing of many of the illusions we created during the age of Pisces as we move further along into this age of Aquarius. From a personal perspective, this is the time for us lightworkers to shine and step up with new information and innovations as for this new age and clear all the obstacles and illusions that are standing in our way from assisting in creating this new earth. We need to let go of the illusion that someone is coming to save us. It is up to us to usher in this new earth. If you'd like to know more about this collective shift in consciousness, please follow me on YouTube and TikTok. You can also visit my website, Christina Syd, that's Christina with the C-H-P-S-Y-D dot com to learn more about the shift in consciousness as well as information regarding my book, The Journey of Discovering Inner Peace, which has many valuable tools, that can be helpful in navigating this challenging yet amazing time. Sending all of you lots of love and light from the heart of Mount Shasta. Wishing all of you a phenomenal summer season and a wonderfully releasing full moon.